Hey, what is going on YouTube? It's Andy CVPI and welcome back to another video. This time as you guys can clearly tell I am driving and I do apologize guys if the sun is in the way but I have no other way basically of driving and as of right now when I'm starting off this video guys I do want to say it is a Friday afternoon and I am getting ready basically to go ahead and uh, wash my car and give you guys a lot of updates and a couple of more things but as, right, as of right now guys I am currently driving to the car wash that's not too far away from here and I am wearing my head strap so therefore if it is hard for you guys to see or you guys can't see as well I do apologize for that in advance. But otherwise than that guys I don't want to really roll up over here because everyone's going to be like what the hell is this guy doing? Why does he have that weird thing on his head? And if you guys are wondering what that sound was that was basically my uh, police scanner. I'm going to squeeze in here real quick because the car wash is going to be not too far away from here. But otherwise than that guys in this video I did receive a special package as you guys can see right here. Right here I just have my phone case and my blender bottles right here. And then I have the tape that I will be putting on my license plate and then my absorber and then a surprise package that many of you guys have been waiting. And as of right here, guys, I am going to be putting on my uh, new renewal license plate sticker. I did end up going to get my emissions a couple days ago. And the good thing is that it checked out. Everything turned out all right. And I will be putting that on as well. In this video right here, I have my absorber just hanging out for now. But other than that, guys, yeah, I'm about to be at the car wash in a bit and basically start cleaning my car and getting right into it but otherwise than that guys you guys already saw my inside nothing crazy nothing special and basically i have my radar right here i have my radio right there it is a pioneer bluetooth here's where i normally do my driving vlog but as of now i will be trying to make it a bit different due to the fact that i have my head strap and i do look kind of goofy like i can't stress that enough with this whole entire head strap this is how i mute my uh, radar but otherwise than that guys i'm gonna get there and show you exactly what i use basically i put in a couple of quarters and i get right into cleaning and if you guys are saying that my car is messing don't get me wrong it is really messy in here obviously i don't have the floor mat yeah i didn't put it in from the last time that i was supposed to and my driving dash my airbag light guys it's always been on i always drive on my overdrive off unless i'm going on a highway and cruising on the highway or going to downtown or something that's when i have overdrive on but otherwise than that my low tire pressure light is on as well and my crown vic and that is because when i was changing on my back tire uh one of the tcp sensor was torn out of it and instead of buying a new uh tcp sensor what i basically ended up doing was just putting on the tire without it so therefore that is exactly why the low tire pressure light is always on and will stay on no matter what but other than that guys, yeah, I can't wait to tell you guys and show you guys how I clean my car. When I clean the car guys, it's basically gonna be a quick little fast forward. I'm not gonna really explain it. But other than that guys, I hope you enjoy this video. So as you guys can clearly tell, I am back from the car wash. I do apologize that I, not, that I did not end up getting the footage of me using the whole entire absorber at the car wash, but that is due to the fact that there were many people in line and just the fact that I was uh, cleaning it actually, guys. A lot of people are like pretty much getting impatient. They don't want to really wait or whatever. So that is actually why I rushed it right away and I did end up coming home right away. And as you guys can clearly tell, my Crown Victoria, it is looking pretty beautiful and clean, but as you guys can clearly tell, the whole entire uh, tires, they are still brand new, but you guys can tell there are no tire shine on it just yet, but I will be basically putting on the uh, tire shine as well, and basically going ahead and still touching it up with the absorber a bit more, due to the fact that the outcome did turn out beautiful. It is looking clean and fresh, just like I love my car all the time. And this is basically how I clean my car each and every single time, guys, when I go to a car wash. What I basically do is uh, put in the quarters and basically use the wash setting and use the rinse setting, which is pretty much soap and water. And basically let it go, spray it down, spray underneath it, and 
basically for two to three dollars I get exactly what I paid for and then I end up driving back to my house really really quick and fast so I could get the whole entire spots off and make sure that there's no such thing as water stains or any spots on it but otherwise than that guys the car is looking beautiful it is looking clean I'm not sure how the whole entire camera is capturing getting all but I do want to say that on video and in person actually it looks way more nicer and better but i do still have to uh get the whole entire absorber because as you guys can tell right here and right here there is a lot of dirt basically leaving the car wash there's a lot of mud stains and dirt so i'm gonna have to go ahead and do this as well and basically get the whole entire rims as well and clean the rims still because there's still water stains and all the stain right here i'm not sure if you guys see it but i do want to take care of that and put on the tire shine but i do love the tires i mean seriously i did i did get these tires probably like four to five months ago and they are beautiful and if you guys want to know a little uh, cheat if you don't know how to check how old the new year tires are there's always serial numbers on them like mine right here so that's 45 17. you find this number guys the first two numbers are the week and then the last two letters are the year so mine were made in the 45th week of 2017 which means that these tires are pretty new and pretty amazing and still ready to go but otherwise than that i'm gonna have to touch up right here right here and basically get the whole entire rim still and i will probably get a video in and i will probably get that in this video or if i don't get it in this video guys i'm basically going to do it in a future video but otherwise than that i am going to get back into my crown victoria and basically show you guys what the whole entire package that i got in the mail so as you guys can tell i did end up buying this package off amazon prime i did buy it off amazon and i do have prime so i love how these shipments come in really quick and fast i mean seriously always amazing it always takes a day ever since i order it's always a day pretty much guys a day or two no more and i end up getting my package in so let's see how this goes and let's see how this looks right here and these guys if you guys are asking they are a nmo antenna so basically this is how exactly it looks i will step outside and obviously before i do go and unpack this and try to see if it fits i do want to say that here i do have my uh, license plate sticker which i will be putting on as well and basically going from there but i do want to apologize guys that in this video i'm not going to be obviously showing this and using the whole entire paste swags or detailing the engine bay due to the fact that i'm running really short on time but otherwise than that let me get my knife again not exactly sure where i put it right here here's how it's looking right now try to just open it if i can like this but it's pretty tight so i'm gonna stab it and slide this could go from there. So it's turning out. Oh, I knew what that was gonna happen to me trying to put my knife away. So this is the brand right here, guys. This is like $35 on Amazon. You could get it. it's pretty dope. It is pretty heavy compared to all the other antennas. And if you guys are asking me where my other antennas, one of them's right there, as you guys can see, laying right there, and then my other one is somewhere nearby as well. But otherwise than that. I'm gonna take this out and try to put it on and show you guys let's see if these fit I mean the problem with me is the reason why I never got these antennas for it is because I wasn't sure if they were gonna fit so moment of truth right here oh yeah that's perfect so it does fit perfectly fine it obviously is on I'm not sure how you guys captured it on video but it does look beautiful, does look clean, and the other one will be coming in actually in two to three days. It is a bit more bigger than that one, and it obviously will stand out as well. But that is going to be in a couple of days that I'm really going to get that one in. So maybe in my week, from a week from today, I will get a whole entire video on detailing it as well, and basically going from there. But otherwise, than that guy, that is going to be it for this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe, and make sure to stay tuned for more videos all the time. And otherwise, than that, thank you so much for watching.